is the little uh, run, if you like. This is the delivery run to get into uh, the back of the new place next door. Stu was down here yesterday, did a bit of cleaning up, got rid of some of the crap on the floor, got rid of lots of empty cans. You can see there's still a lot of crap in these bins. You would have thought he'd have emptied them, wouldn't you, the bugger? So yeah, we've uh, got that area cleaned out. We just got back in the unit and uh, I'll show you what we've been doing this morning. I've spent a good hour on the computer with uh, Matt from Viewplan, Viewplan BMS, which for me is the best brewery management software on the market for the price. 500 quid a year plus a yearly subscription for the support package of £80, which ain't a lot of money if you ask me. And uh, he's installed it for me on this computer. Now, I don't know how much of this I can show you guys because, of course, it's, uh, it's somebody else's software. But I do recommend that if you're going to open up a brewery, this is the guy to speak to. Uh, so yeah, we can get in here. And you will see the main screen. So uh, I'm going to have to take a break at lunchtime in about an hour, hour and a half. Uh, basically just to give you guys some content on the video because other than that I have to spend all day now running through this system and populating everything such as stock we can see we got no stock we can see we've got no brew plan you know uh, how do we get out of that there's an exit up there look uh, brew management Three fermenters, nothing in them. Uh, brew history, nothing on it. So all this stuff needs populating. Product profiles, we've got to add the beers onto here. We've got to add all the new beers. So yeah, I'm uh, quite familiar with the system, but it ain't exactly conducive to riveting viewing, folks. So, yeah, we will come back once all this has been stuck on. In fact, I won't get it all done today. I need to do a stock take as well. And, you know, it's a bigger job than I'm letting on. So the idea is we'll take a chance for a walk at lunchtime and then I can carry on this afternoon. And then if I'm lucky, I am always over uh, optimistic about what I'm gonna achieve in a day. And I never seem to, because I'm not, uh, I'm not superhuman. And I expect superhuman things to be achieved. So yeah, if things go to plan, we'll be rigging up for the brew day. I would have brewed today, had I not had to do this install this morning. So HLT, grains, clean out one of the fermenters, chase up these casks. Still didn't get an email back from Crusader, but hey ho. Anyway, enough of me waffling. I've got work to do. I'm just having a walk up and down the unit at the moment. It's three o'clock. Never did get a chance to take uh, the doggy for a walk. The poor boy. It was a bit cooler out there as well. So I literally got sat in front of that. BMS system and yes I've spent all day putting ingredients profiles in customer profiles not many of them uh, beer profiles everything you can imagine and I feel sort of oh I just I just need to get up on my feet like the ingredients profiles for instance you've got to put everything on there like black malt, the price, the quantity you've got in stock, who you buy it from, what their telephone number is, all the contact details, and then pale malt, and then cara malt, and then Chris, you can imagine every single tier, every single ingredient has to be input with about 15 different boxes to fill in on every single one. And uh, 
you have to do the same for you. You have got to get all this in before you can start adding your recipes in there. And then when you've got your recipes in there, then you can start to populate your brew days. I'm not even that far yet. I've got the vacant in. That's the only recipe I've got on there. It's a real ball ache. So what I've actually done is set up something called remote desktop. Uh, I think a few of you will be familiar with it. And I'm going to go home. I'm going to sit in the back garden with a nice cold brewski and the sun on my face. And uh, we're going to input the rest of the details at leisure. So today is totally a computer day. Totally a computer day. So that means all of this is going to be done. Then I've got to edit the vlog. People have been drinking our beer as well. The craft keg that we put on yesterday has gone. So Gemma's taken another corny up. And I'm surprised that sold so quickly because it was really murky for a craft keg. It was brune almost. Well, you saw it, didn't you, on yesterday's vlog? It was really quite a murky one. But yeah, it's gone anyway, so uh, Gemma's taken that up. Doesn't look like we're gonna get around to a brew day, setting everything up for a brew day. There's not much point until I've got all the BMS system singing and a dancing. And then once that's working properly, then we can give it its first test run by printing out a brew sheet. <sighs> Bloody admin. It's admin, admin, admin. There's no, literally, there's no glory about owning a brewery until all of this admin is in its right and proper place. Hence the reason why I bought the BMS system in the first place. I can only imagine how difficult it is for you brewers out there who have commercial breweries without a BMS. What a killer. Right, enough waffle. That's another three minutes of waffle for you to contend with there. Let's get in the car. Let's take the dog for a quick walk and pick the kids up. Gemma's just nipped into town. Dominic's birthday this week. And Gemma's, by the way. Wonder what we're going to do for that. <sighs> I don't know. I'm skint. I'll have to come up with something. Hmm. She does need a new washing machine. Come on then. Well then have a shake. What are you throwing at my hey. <laughs> She's not happy about this. Are you Jeremy? You ready? Whoa. How you doing? <laughs> so that's it. What time is it, do you reckon? Seven. Seven o'clock. We're pretty much just packed up on the uh, remote desktop access to the brewery computer where I've put together the uh, uh, ingredient profiles and managed to get GAL1 listed on there. The system's evolved a little bit since I last used it so it's going to take me a couple of weeks to get used to all the new bits and bobs. It shouldn't be too bad. Uh, I was really contemplating some filler for the rest of the vlog but quite frankly I'll be wasting your time and mine. I was going to film Gemma cooking dinner, when I love? She's got some cabbage on the go. What else she got going? Some green beans. Some green beans. Oh, hey up. <laughs> you like that? And I've got some cider. Bit of cider. Mmm. Lazing in the back garden like there's nothing better to do than winding Gemma up. 
All right. What do you mean? <laughs> Doing it to me. Right then. You don't like being on the camera, do you? Not particularly. No, not when you're just lounging around most of the time. Not like doing anything. I'm kidding. Right, well, there we go. I ain't gonna get more interesting than this unless like a meteor strikes the planet or something. Then I guess I wouldn't be doing an upload, would I? So, we'll have to see. Leave me alone.